Well, howdy. My name's Roggin. I'm that funny guy with that funny name that rides dirt bikes and snowmobiles and all the like, and I'm uh, someone who lives in Colorado. And, uh, well, currently I'm making videos in my basement, which isn't usual for me, because usually I make videos outside. But, um, in the midst of the coronavirus pandemic, I've decided that um, I'm gonna start making YouTube videos again, where most people are like, I can't make YouTube videos anymore. It's just um, so difficult um, that, you know, I have to stay inside and I don't have no creativity. Well, screw that! We don't do that around here. We're gonna be um, making some more videos and uh, we're gonna be rebuilding my dirt bike, which I blew up. I was like, <clears throat> be making some snowmobile videos and uh, well, we're gonna make what you guys want, but I'm the center of the show. I've rebranded the name of the channel. It's no longer Some Frickin' Films. We've gotten rid of some. <laughs> Gone, out of here. It's just Frickin' Films. Roggin' Frick is the center of attention. This is the Roggin' Show. And um, we're gonna be talking about all my adventures. I'm gonna do some dumb things, probably. We'll see, because uh, I have a long history of doing dumb things. So who am I? Uh, I'm Rogan Frick. Uh, it's not Rogan, it's not Roger, it's not Reagan, it's not um, Rabbit, it's not Rogaine. Sometimes it's Rogaine, but that's only at a, at a dirt bike race. That's only for Tel Gore. And uh, yeah, seems like nobody can understand my name. Um, I tell it to him about a thousand times. Yeah, it's, it's Roggin, Roggin Frick. Uh, Roger did. No, that's, that's Roggin Frick. Oh, you're that Seth Rogen guy, huh, on, on the um, Pineapple Express? Yeah, that's me. I'm Seth Rogen, and uh, I'm gonna be making some videos. No, I'm not Seth Rogen. Never will be Seth Rogen. He should rebrand his name to Seth Rogen because it's a better name. It's far superior. Where was I at last time? So I was progressing my action sports career on my YouTube channel with a total of 136 subscribers. I was trying to backflip a dirt bike because I decided, yeah, I've never landed a flip before on my feet or on a snowboard or on um, a video game or on a trampoline or on a diving board. So I should backflip my dirt bike. Yeah, that really went really well. Um, ruined the old butt end of that thing. And then um, I decided, huh, revolutionary ideas. What if I went and backflipped a bicycle first or second? Well, um, we did that and we backflipped a bicycle. And then no more. That was the end of it because I went and broke my back and uh, wrecked the end of the, the ass end of the dirt bike again. Well, past that point, I just kind of stopped doing YouTube. I kind of just got focused on doing school all the time. And uh, I kind of got focused on going and doing dumb things with all my friends all the time. Uh, you know, just cruising around or sitting on my ass or I don't really know what else, but uh, stopped making videos and I'm, um, yeah, I've, I've videoed a lot of things, but I didn't really do anything with it. And uh, here I am today, I'm deciding that I'm gonna try it again with the knowledge that I know because I never used to um, take the knowledge I used on YouTube and apply it to making YouTube videos. So, you know, that was real smart. So who am I? Well, I'm an A-class dirt bike rider. just won the 258 championship at the Weeby Racing Series. Um, you know, that wasn't a really big achievement. It sounds a lot bigger than it was because, uh, well, this year, because of Corona, as there's three races and all I had to do was show up. So, um, officially earned title. I'm the B-Class champion because I did, I did earn that one. I'm a funny guy with a funny name. Um, I'm from Colorado, born and raised on the Western Slope. I've been about everywhere in Colorado. Um, I used to do work closing abandoned mines, which there is a ton of in Colorado. Don't go in them, they will kill you. I'm a business owner. I 
Last time I was making videos, I had a business. I made grizzly rock screens for the construction industry. Stopped doing that. And then I decided to do it again today. So uh, yeah, this is what a grizzly rock screen looks like, but much bigger. Um, you pick it up with a piece of equipment. That's my company right there. This is a little scale model that we made. Um, so yeah, I'm running the online parts of that now. And uh, father's running the operations. I also happen to uh, be a construction management major. I do work on construction projects. I'm about to graduate this semester and uh, move into a career of construction and uh, we're gonna build buildings out there, yeah. We're gonna go and we're gonna get the two by fours and the, the, the hammer and we're just gonna slap it together, yeah. In all seriousness, though, um, I'm also a filmmaker or a wannabe filmmaker because I uh, do enjoy making YouTube videos on the internet and uh, like making videos of just me doing dumb stuff with my buddies. I like making skits, I like doing just different funny things. So, what do I want to do on YouTube? Well, I want to make funny videos. I want to make badass videos, but also, most importantly, I want to make entertaining videos. I want to make videos that you guys want to watch. I, my content's mostly going to be focused around me and uh, whatever I happen to be doing. Um, I'd like that to mostly be dirt biking and snowmobiling and snowboarding and doing just Colorado outdoor activities. But it's also going to be a little bit of a, a little bit of my business mixed in there sometimes every once in a while. Uh, maybe a little bit of construction or whatever you guys would like to see. I'm going to judge your reactions. Um, if you guys got any ideas whatsoever, please, you know, leave a comment down below. And I don't know if anybody will or not, because it's been a little bit since I made videos. I don't even know if anybody's going to see this video, in all honesty. Um, I got a couple buddies that are going to start watching this. And right now, you know, I'm just kind of making videos for my friends to watch, see what I'm doing, because um, I'm, I'm out here and... You know, everyone's kind of went all different ways across the country. I got friends all over the place. And uh, we're all spread out, and I don't see them as much as anymore. But because of social media and whatnot, I'm able to be connected with everybody via my YouTube channel. And that's going to be my sole means of being connected with everybody. So if you think you're interested in watching my videos and what I have to do and different things about me, well, please like and subscribe, and we'll see you in the next one.